What's up, family? It's Professor T. We're back with some more reacting to Undiscovered Music. And today, we're continuing <coughs> Women's Appreciation Month. We're sorry, it's not really continuing. I had to get another computer. So the struggle I've had getting everything set back up on this new computer made me miss a lot of time. But we're good. The camera quality is looking real crispy. And we're going to get into this now. So shout out to Faith Wayne. She did not have a um, bio, but she has a YouTuber. She has several originals that are on her channel. It's what is called Off White. I'm going to check this one out. I've pre-screened it as always. So the Off White is a reference to the Off White, like the um, fashion brand. This new HD camera. I'm seeing like every little flaw in my face. This little chat on my lip right here too. Um, ignore that. Ignore that. <laughs> All right. Let's get to this song so I can stop. Sh I can shut up and play the music. Shut up and play the music to you. you always talk too much. So, this is in the genre of sitting in your bedroom playing guitar type music, which is fine. There's nothing wrong with that. You know, it's cool. That's something special where you can play the guitar and sing at the same time, though. There's extra stuff going on too, which is why I, I did this one. Because it's not just playing a guitar in, in your bedroom. It's like stuff that's happening in the background. There's like the little vocals coming in, which is really cool. She has a good voice too. I wish that she had a bio that was on her YouTube page. Because she looks super young. Like I wonder how like how old she is. Does she look super young to you guys? Like That's dope. That's right. She's really talented. The lyricism is good too. It's like conscious. It's conscious. I know it's conscious rap. It's conscious acoustic thing. That's what this is like with the lyric. It's like conscious acoustic. I like this though. I've never been able to play the guitar. I'm jealous of people that have been able to work that out. I've tried, but it's just something with the strings. I can't properly, maybe it's because my hands are big or something, I don't know. But there's people that are like giants that play guitar, so. The song is nice though. It's, it's soothing, it's relaxing. It's just something simple, something nice. Conscious hip hop, conscious acoustic. So I like it. It's tight. All right, pause if you don't need no advertisements popping in. All right, y'all, back to my pretty face. See you. My review of that song, I like that. That was real nice right there. Real relaxing, real smooth. You know, everything doesn't have to be explosive Professor T sound. You know what I mean? Tell me what's quick ties too. Because like, my mic is over here, but the camera is over here. I'm just, I'm worried if like the the sound, my voice is going to be like in one side of your ear. Anyways, though, to the point. So yeah, with this song, as you could tell, it's something acoustic, something nice, real simple, real soft. You know, it doesn't have to be Professor T bombastic. I uh, like my beats are, but I like that. It's a nice instrumental. I like how the, the background vocals came in. I like how it was kind of, you know, like I said, it was a meaningful song. It had a little bit of like a conscious vibe to it. Um, critiques. If I were to give this any critiques, it's like, it's not really like I got any critiques to give it because it's pretty good. It's pretty simple. Like, how much is there to really critique with this? The guitar playing was good. Just very simple guitar playing. And that goes to show how sometimes just the simple is the best way to go. You don't have to be... It's, it could just be something simple and catchy. You don't have to get carried away with the you know melodies that you're doing and the you know way that she's singing. Just real light. Um, so if, if I were to say any critiques for it, I would say maybe, as I said, this isn't a critique because it's the style of music that it is. It's a critique maybe because I just don't... Personally, I'm not drawn to that style of music. It would be inter more interesting to hear that like... Um, more 
instrumentation as in it, as just like I had mentioned, just sitting in your bedroom playing guitar kind of a vibe, which is cool too. But I would just say it would be nice to see some more. So I definitely would look forward to checking out some more of her video because she's pretty good. I bet you she probably has a lot more varied sounds that she does. So without any further ado, it's time to go to my favorite part. It's time to go to the Professor T Billboard chart. That was loud. I better check. They're going to be like my neighbors. All right. Let's go to the bill. All right, guys. Due to some technical difficulties, I got to come back in afterward. And I got to record my thoughts on the billboard chart. So we're going to go into it. So as you can see, I'm moving up, moving it up, moving it up. I liked it a little bit more than Dwayne, more than Lucky, more than 33 dogs. Moved it up a little higher. Put it in around some of the other kind of softer music. Moved up above the brass machine. I put it right below Anthony Casuccio's track, Friends First. So that slots Faith in at number 19. So she's below Friends First. That was Anthony Casuccio's first attempt at a country song. And it's right above the brass machine, I Think I Love You. So that's a pretty good little uh, spacing right there in the top 20 for right now. As always, comment on these. This is not a reflection on the quality of the song. This is just a reflection of the Billboard chart, what I think is going to be the most popular, what people will like the best. So good work, Faith. And to Faith, to all you guys watching at home, love what you do. I enjoyed listening to this song, and I hope all of you did too. And I spread nothing but peace and love to all of you, and I'll see you on the next review.